Welcome back everyone, I'm Genevieve Moongarden and I'm here hanging out with Professor Lydia Greyrose because King's Isle dropped another caramel teaser and I'm really excited for this new world. So let's explore the new info as well as a recap of the previously teased stuff. Let's get to it. So the image that they showed today was of a lovely, wonderful, candy looking, pink, fluffy, ram with very large candy cane horns now this looks an awful lot like the alpine ibex which of course is found in the alpine of switzerland perhaps or maybe sweetsburg i'm guessing in addition you can see some interesting stuff in the background perhaps there is a, an ice river flowing around this there's snow this is obviously really high up in the mountains because it's craggy and there's snow. But in addition, you can see some rocks, which I think look a lot like rock candy, perhaps. And some of them, it looks like the crystals that you get like in Dragon Spire for housing decoration. There's also candy cane version and then one that's possibly like a rock candy because there's a blue one, there's a pink one from what we can see in the teaser. Uh, in addition, we can see some other of these rams we can only guess on what they're going to be called but there's another little thing you can see right behind or technically between the horns of this creature which it looks like the entrance to a mine so maybe these guys are guarding it maybe this is why some of the rock crystals are growing here because this is where they mine some of the candy stuff now personally i think these rams look a lot like cotton candy with candy cane horns we can only wait and see Professor Greyrose has reminded me of some of the things that have already been revealed by King's Isle. Now, some of the places that we already know are in existence are Sweetsburg, which is a playoff of Salzburg. There's Nibbleton. There's also Soda Lake, which all of these places sound awesome. I hope that we get to go underneath Soda Lake. I really love it when we get to go underwater in these places. Technically, it's not water, so it might be kind of gross. You never know. And from... Lydia Gray Rose's previous history, we learned about Gobblerton and of course the Brothers Bon Bon. I don't think that they're gonna be making an appearance unless they're pretty immortal because this was way back when Merle Ambrose was very young and just starting out looking for professors for Ravenwood. So I personally don't think that the Brothers Bon Bon are still around, but there are still a problem with witches. In addition, we know that the Cabal is going to be, I think, a pretty big part in Caramel because these have been put out as spoilers, so they're not 100% confirmed, but they, they did confirm that the Cabal is going to be in Caramel. But there's been spoilers about Mole Thief and Cabalist Chicken Miner in particular. Now, in addition to us being shown particular residents of Caramel, one of which, of course, being the most famous, which is Nana herself. There's also Bryce Crispy and a female hamster who is labeled as a jellymancer. Hopefully we will not be learning that school. That sounds a bit icky, but if you look at the jellymancer's glasses, they've got the little chains hanging down them. So I'm thinking this might be a hardworking jellymancer that she needs to uh, keep her glasses on. Also, we've been introduced to Creature Apple Brutal, which looks tasty. I'm so afraid of this one. It's tasty and scary at the same time. And in an earlier teaser, they showed us a look at Caramel City. And in the teaser for Caramel City, some things really stood out to me. There's something that looks like an info booth, or perhaps you can buy chocolates or pet snacks here. That would be super awesome if it was pet snacks. In the tree, it kind of looks like it could be a tail of a squirrel or an acorn hanging out. I'm not sure what it is. There's an awesome clock tower in the background. And there's something that looks like it could be one of Nana's factories. And then also there's some sort of gondola type apparatus. It could be transportation or it could be something fun. I hope that it is how we travel around in this. That would be super awesome to get like a bird's eye view of this place. Also inside the main building here in the front, there's some posters and I'm not sure if these are ads or Nana's propaganda. We'll just have to wait and see. 
And another thing that they revealed to us on the last KI Live is that they really loved Pirate 101's Akulian reference to Arnold Schwarzenegger. So they told us that there's going to be a Sylvester Stallone one in Caramel. Now, I love this movie. It's a bit cheese, but it's fun action movie. The only one I can think of that they would be referencing in Caramel would be Cliffhanger. If you haven't seen it, you gotta watch it. It's great. But I, I can only guess. I don't know what they would what the quest would be or the reference. Hopefully it's an NPC. I just really, really can't wait. I love it so much. And that's it so far for this update. Let me know what you guys think. Are you excited for this? Do you think it's meh? You wish it was some other world coming out? Personally, I am super excited for this world. I have been wanting this ever since we first met the Gobblers in Colossus Boulevard. I can't wait. So thank you guys for checking out this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!